Hi, this is Chad Ng. I'm the project team lead for Doremi Online Auto Management System. Here on the screen, we have the high level uh, representation of the process flow of the solution. It basically describes the seven key stages for each sales order in the solution. So we have one, uh, which is draft, and two is confirm, three is approved, four is cancel, five is packing. Six is shipped, and finally, uh, the last status is closed. So you can see from this diagram, uh, each sales order will flow through the various uh, statuses, and the system is built in such a way where a rules engine will make decision during key uh, key stage of the solution. For instance, the during approval, the rules engine will make decision to apply discounts and also uh, to also check the inventory stock balance, whether an order can be fulfilled or not. With that, I'd like to move on to my next team member to describe uh, further details on the solution. Thank you. I've identified the top goal for this project, is how to implement an online processing management system with sales transaction and inventory control. Here is the inference diagram we have constructed. There are four goals at top level inference, which are order processing management, account, business intelligence module, and the inventory management. There are several sub goals on the list goals, and we also summarize and categorize observables and the facts on the each sub goals. Based on this, we have designed and built a rule based online order processing management system. This is the process flow of the system. There are five rules applied in the system. The bulk order rule will judge the order is bulk order or not. Balance checking rule will check if the stock balance is enough for the non bulk orders. Then the best discount rule will apply the best available discount on the order. The auto approve rule will auto approve the order below $1,000 and when a successful order is completed, the auto top up rule will top up the credit points for the customer. This system is very intelligent, efficient with high accuracy. It can save much manpower and timing for the company to make the company become more competitive in the market. Next, we will talk about knowledge specific Online music books ordering system design. One of the issues feedback from customers is because there are so many sales promotions and the price can be depends on many factors. And the current IT department takes too long to make these changes. What I propose is a dynamic volume dependent discount determination modeling. The basic idea is from the supply and demand relationship in a macroeconomic model. Uh, as shown in this plot, at a certain demand level and supply level, the price and the sales quantity can reach an equilibrium uh, to maximize the profit. Uh, as during the holiday season, normally the demand level is increased, and if we can increase the supply level, normally the quantity can be significantly increased at a slightly lower price. This can maximize the profit. Uh, this formula shows the relationship between the discount and the total dollar amount. Uh, during the holiday season, such as the school opening period, the N value can be set as a slightly higher value uh, for high strength of the promotion to match up with the higher demand. Uh, normally, the discount is in the form of the credit points. All these parameters can be refined and optimized during the customer feedback circle. Hi, this is a quick demo of the Doremi booking system. First, we log in. Once we log in, we go to the customer page. We can check whether a customer exists or not by entering the email address. If the customer doesn't exist, we can use the add button to add new customer. Then we go to the sales order. We create a new sales order and save. The sales order has been created and we enter the product details for this sales order. Once we save it, we go back to the sales order and we change 
the status to confirm. Once it is confirmed, the backend row engine will apply the best discount to this rule and check if the balance is under the limit and whether it can be approved or not. In the event log, we can see for order four, it has been created, updated from jumping to confirm and processed by several rules. Once the order has been set to approve, the warehouse team will receive an email saying the order is ready for packing. Okay, now let's log off and log in as a warehouse team member. First, we go to sales order. We check the approved sales order and we change to packing because we need to pack the stock. Once we save it, we go to the shipment. When the packing is done, we need to create a new shipment. We enter the shipment date and the tracking number and save it. Then the order is under shipment, but not delivered yet. We have a dummy logistic system to auto set the shipment to deliver. We can enter the tracking number and uh, enter confirm delivery. And we refresh the page. You can see the shipment has been delivered. And when, if we go back to sales order, for sales order four, it has been closed because the order has been fulfilled and the email will be sent to sales team to notify the order has been closed. And we can also check the order status from the dashboard. Then next, we have an auto purchase order function. We can run this auto PO after the auto PO is done and purchase order will be created automatically based on the product we sell. Here is okay. This is a this is the end of the demo. For more user case, please refer to the report. Thank you.